No surprise necessarily about the win. A big surprise what happened to Justin Rose. Look at this at the 12. Some missed short putts here on his way to a triple bogey eight. And as a result, Justin Rose not getting the result he required to finish the year as world number one, a 75. In fact, his worst score of 2018, he finished outside the top 10. Sharp contrast to the round of the day came from the Malaysian, Nicky Fung. There were hopes of a 59 at one stage, but he had to settle for around a 62. One of those days where not much happened for Henrik Stenson. That was one of only two birdies in a round of 71. Fourth place, the Swede had to settle for at 14 under par. Another fantastic round came from a player who has finished top five twice previously at the Indonesian Masters. An eagle finish for Titipan Chuiprakong in a round of 64. Some of the best golf of the day came from Panapol Pitiara, the player known as Coconut, a winner this year of the Thailand Open with a 66 to finish in third place at 15 under par. In fact, it was a 1-2-3 from Thailand, finishing one up with two eagles on his back nine was Jazz Jane Watanon. But they're all left trailing behind this man. Pum Saksansen, who started the final round with a three-shot lead, was never caught after. A fantastic opening salvo there with that birdie at the first. In fact, no one actually caught him throughout this final day. A part of the last and a round of 68, 20 under par and a three-shot victory for the 25-year-old from Thailand. Poom Saksansen, the champion for the second time in three editions. He is the 2018 BNI Indonesian Masters champion.